We were talking about a national child care program because the NDP has made a commitment to make that a high priority in the next federal election campaign. I think it was first introduced as a federal issue by the Royal Commission on the Status of Women in 1970. And at that time, I didn't have children yet. I'm now a grandmother, and my daughter's generation is struggling with childcare the same way we did. So it's been all those years. It's about time. It's obviously good for children. Children can really, really thrive in good quality childcare programs. There's a lot of research that supports that. Obviously, it's really important for parents for families so that they can work, so that they can train, so that if they're newcomers to Canada, that they can study English, all of those kinds of things it's absolutely critical for. But don't forget it's also really critical for women's equality because women aren't only part of a family, but it's been one of the pillars of women's equality. Without childcare, women can't really participate in the workforce. When you put all those things together, you know, what you see is that it ends up to being something that's really positive for the society at large. I think it'll play out politically in two ways. One way it'll play out politically is that um, putting it out into the public debate at this time, I think will really open the public debate up leading up until the federal election. And I think that's incredibly important. I think the second political element of this is where is the money going to come from? We have been told again and again that we need re the, the way to have a good country is to reduce taxes, that the more we can reduce taxes, public spending, the better off people are going to be. I think there's a growing body of ed evidence that that's not true. So as we've reduced tra taxes at all levels of government, we see potholes in the streets, we see large class sizes, we see all kinds of um, you know long wait times for health care, underspending in health care. People are paying for child care out of their own pockets. The other way you can spend money is you can put money into the tax pool and make it into a program so that people aren't paying the kinds of user fees that people are now paying out of their own pockets for childcare. So there's a whole taxation argument that I'm hoping to see is raised as an important issue in the, in the federal election. And I think a national childcare program fits right into that.